Lorraine Kelly says she thinks that there will be a tipping point soon where Prince Harry and Meghan Markle will be stripped of their titles. Lorraine spoke to royal expert Russell Myers about Meghan and Harry's respective press appearances in the U.S. on Tuesday. After Harry addressed the dangers of social media to a re wired panel event and Meghan spoke about the toxicity of the tabloid media, Lorraine shared her thoughts with Russell. The Mirror Royal expert said Meghan and Harry were in a grey area of still using their Duke and Duchess titles despite stepping back from the royal family. Lorraine replied, I've always said it was very sad. I totally get where they're coming from. It's a difficult one. I think there will be a tipping point where they will have to give up their titles if they want to go into politics or do more. But they will still be Harry and Meghan. They will still have clout. Russell replied, The issue is they banned a lot of the press who were unfriendly to them. And if you're not prepared to take criticism, you need to take a look at yourself about what you're doing. Surely you're better changing things from the inside rather than the outside in. During his interview, Harry claimed he had warned Twitter CEO Jack Dorsey about the site allowing a coup to be staged only days before Trump supports stormed the Capitol building after Joe Biden's election victory. He said, Jack and I were emailing each other prior to January 6 when I warned him his platform was allowing a coup to be staged. That email was sent the day before. And then it happened. And I haven't heard from him since. Meanwhile, Meghan spoke to Andrew Ross Sorkin at the DealBook Online Summit about her calls to members of Congress for support over paid family leave for new parents in the U.S. She said she believed it was not a political issue but a humanitarian one, saying, this is one of those issues that is not red or blue. It sets us up for economic growth and success, but it also just allows people to have that very sacred time as a family. It takes strong men, modern men, to really understand they benefit from it as well, and it is not just about the mom.